Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to restore the default settings that you have set for your Valorant game. So this pertains to the, um, the graphical settings, the audio settings, as well as the key binds that you have for your game. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And the reason for this video is because um, with most games, you would think that there'd be a built-in system where you simply need to press a button to restore your game settings to default. Now, the thing with Valorant is uh, it doesn't actually have a, a feature like that that's natively supported. So we're going to try a different way to restore the default settings for Valorant. And to do so is quite simple. And I'm actually going to switch to Windows here real quick. And the idea is we're going to be getting access to the uh, uh, configuration files or any files for Valorant. <clears throat> and to get there, we would need to access uh, the local app data folder. And to get there is quite simple. The first thing that you guys need to do is you need to hit um, the Windows key on your keyboard and R to bring up the run window. So it looks like this. And from here, we're going to type down app data. And once you do that, hit enter and it's going to pull up your file explorer for Windows. Now from here, you guys are going to select the local folder and basically make your way down, navigate through the folders and look for the Valorant folder. So I actually don't have um, Valorant installed on my PC, but basically just look for Valorant here. And then you'd want to uh, click on the folder and delete it. Now, uh, this is not going to mess up your game in any way. It's just going to delete the um, configuration files that they have in store for your game. So the, uh, the, this pertains to the graphical settings, the audio settings, as well as your key binds for Valorant, like your mouse settings and crosshair settings and whatnot. So um, what's going to happen is the game is going to generate a new batch of um, files for it. And it's going to be, it's going to contain the default values or settings that it has for Valorant. And that's honestly all there is to it. So yeah, that's the video. So thank you guys for watching. Hopefully it helped you out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. So with that said, um, we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.